Hey, what is up guys? Phoenix here, and today we're going to be working on a new Pixlr tutorial. Um, recently just finished the Freddy Fazbear one, and now I have to do the Bonnie one as promised. Uh, so if I don't sound too good in this Pixlr, I want to let you guys know that I do have kind of a headache right now, but I wanted to get this video at least started or finished it completely so I can start uploading the parts. So bear with me. So first off, we're going to go over what we're going to be doing in this video, which is just framework. So pretty much all you're going to need is black wool and any other type of block that you can use to um, get placing correctly. So let's start. First we're going to pick our point, which I just put one right here just so I can know where I am. And we're going to go one block down and we're going to go up and to the right nine single blocks. So this is one, two, three, four. I don't know why I put placement blocks if I only use the black wool anyways, so I'm just going to use black wool. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So that's going to be the start of our pixel art for the Bonnie pixel art. And from there, we're going to go up and to the right 3 flat. Like that. And we're going to build the shoulder and the bow tie. I want to get as much of the frame done as possible. Um, hopefully I can get some of the head done because I know people don't like only building the bodies. So we're going to go up and to the right from here, one block. And then from there we're going to start going up and to the left to get the roundness of the shoulder. So we're going to put our placement blocks to the left here and come up five single, um, five vertical pieces of black wool. So one, two, three, four, five. Now following that, we're going to put our placement block to the right of that final block, and we're going to put three on top of that vertical. So one, two, three. And I take it that you guys know to remove your placement blocks after the end of each step, so that's why I'm not saying remove it. Um, you guys can do it on your own. Alright, now we're going to put a placement block to the right here, and put two on top of that. So we're going to go one, two. And here we're going to start getting a little bit more round with it. So we're going to go up and to the right three single blocks. So one, two, three. Then up and to the right two flat. And then two flat again. So it's two sets of two flat. So we're going to go one, two, one, two. Just like that. Oh my god. And that's it for the left side. Let's see. Yep, pretty easy. So now let's start the bow tie and then the lower jaw part. And we'll do the inner workings of her lower part of her body in a bit. But I really want to start the face as soon as possible. So we're, from here we're going to go one, two. We have the two right here. We're going to go up and to the right, two flat. And from that final block on the two flat, what we're going to do is we're going to put three on top of that. So one two three and then below that we're gonna add another six so one two three four five six so three on top six below of that block now we're gonna go to the top where we first put the three and on this final block we're gonna add two to the right from there we're gonna go to the final block of there and we're going to put one on top and bring it over six to the right. So it's seven blocks, but the first one's already there. So we'll put this one. Now let's add six to the right. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now let's start building the lower jaw of the pixel art, which is pretty simple to do. And once we do the lower jaw, we'll do the right side of her, and then we'll start the head. Hopefully we have enough time. So... We're going to skip this first block, so we're going to put a placement, actually we don't need to, just skip it, and to the left of it, put two flats, that's going to be where her head starts later, and then below it, we're going to start the jaw, so let's go below it, and we're going to go to where we have right here, you see how we have these two, this first block, we're going to go below it, and we're going to add six going to the right, so one, two, three, one, two, three. Now from there, we're going to go below this final block, and we're going to go 8 to the right. So we put 1 there, 
and seven to the right, so it's eight blocks. So this is one, we just need seven more. One, two, three. Now here's where we're gonna use our placement block. We're gonna put one to the right here, and below it we're gonna add one, and to the right of it we're gonna add eight again. One, two, three, four. Now we're going to do some up and to the right flat work. So we're going to go up and to the right three flat. Then up and to the right two flat. And actually to keep the, to keep the connectivity going, instead of just going up and to the right two flat, we can bring this over and have a touching right there. So I have a touching like that. So that's two in a row. So it's like three, three. And then we'll do a three again. So we'll go on top of the final block and put three. And then from there, what we're going to do is on the final block, we're just going to add one to the top of that. Then we're going to go up and to the right one again. So it looks like this. Then we're going to go up and to the right two flat, then two flat again. So up and to the right, not connected, two flat, then up and to the right two flat. And I was watching another pixel artist, um, but I like to see how other people do it on YouTube. And kind of had a second camera looking like the way I have it during time lapses. So once I get the frame built, I'll put in a second camera so you guys are able to see how much progress we have left on the pixel art. Because I think it's amazing to see like how much you progress and motivates you to actually finish it. Alright, so from here, we're going to up and to the right two flat again. And we're going to put one block on top of this first one and that's just gonna mark her jaw so I mean mark her face so we have that face marker over there and this face marker over here and that's pretty much what we need and let's actually put one block let's go to the left here and put one block touching just like that all right now we're gonna go down and build her right side because that was her left side of her arm. This is where the bow tie is supposed to be and this is gonna be her right side before we start the face. So we can get an idea of how big she actually is. If she's a she. I think Bonnie's a she. Hopefully I'm not getting this wrong. Alright, so we're gonna put our placement block below right here. And to the right of it we're gonna put two blocks going to the right. And on that final block we're gonna go down and put one below it. Next, we're going to go down to the right, two flat again. So down to the right, two flat. Then from that final block into two flat, we're going to put two below it, and we're going to do something with each of those blocks. So the first one, what we're going to do is add three to the right of it. So one, two, three. And the second one, what we're going to do is add six to the right of it. So we have one, two, three. And we'll do it again, one, two, three. And it should look exactly like that. Now we're going to do a little bit of a marking indentation for when we start the bow later. But we're not going to work too much on it now. So what we're going to do is skip this first block. And on the second and third block we're going to go and put two. And then two again just like that. And that's going to be marked later for when we do our bow tie. I'll hopefully remember to come back to it. If anything, I'll just do that and bring it over to here, but hopefully we work a little bit more with it later. Anyways, let's get back to building more of the frame. So we're going to go to the right now to where we have this six sticking out. And below the final block, we're going to go and put two going to the right. Then we're going to do that again two more times. So this is the first time. Let's do it two more times. Just like that. Now we're going to go below it and put our placement block. And we're going to come down to the right, three vertical. One, two, three. And then from there, we're going to go to the right of the final block and come down two. So one, two. And now we're going to hit the arm part. So the arm part is really difficult, so just follow along closely. So we're going to go down into the right, a backwards L shape. So down into the right backwards L like this, it's just three blocks. 
And then below that, we're going to have a forward L shape. So we're going to go below this and put our forwards L. So here was the backwards L. And here's the forwards L. All right. And now from that forwards L, we're going to go to the right of these two blocks and put three more. So one, two, three. And then below that, we're going to do another, like a copy layer. So we're going to copy it exactly. Except on the left side, we're going to add one more. And on the right side, we're going to add two more. From there, let's see if we have any more room on our right. Yes, we do. So from there, what we're going to do is we're going to go down into the right at a repetitive pattern. So we're going to go down into the right two. And actually, we can do some of the filling now. So rather than just go down into right two, what we're going to do is bring it back for a second. So actually, we can leave these here. To the left of this, add two. Because this was going to be filled in later with some of the shading, but we can just add it now since it's black wool. So this is not outlined. This is actually shading of the arm. So we have this two right here, and then we have this two that we just placed down at the right. From this final two, what we're going to do is come down another two like this. So we just have like these bricks, these big chunky bricks. And we're going to come down from this block another chunky brick. So we're going to put two, two, just like that. Then from there, instead of another chunky brick, we're going to come to the right two going down, just like this. And then to the right of that bottom block, we're going to bring it over two to the right. So one, two. Let me just zoom out real quick so you guys can see what we have so far. Yeah, so it doesn't look diff much different. Not much detail yet, but we're getting there. Alright, so let's go back to where we had before. And from this part right here, we're going to go down below it. Two flat, just like this. So from the final block, we added two blocks going flat. And then up from this one, we're going to go down, add one block. And to the right of that block we just placed, we're going to put two, and on the middle block we're going to put one below it. Now let's go to this final block over here. And we're going to go down to the right, three vertical. So put your placement block down to the right, three vertical. And we're going to make it look like an L, so we're going to put one block to the right on the final piece. And then from there, we're going to go down into the right two vertical, I mean two single, and then so two single, and then down into the right two vertical. Now let's finish this up. So now we're going to go down into the right two vertical again. Then we're going to go down into the right one single, then an L, then two flat, and we should be on the ground. So now we have the entire lower half of her frame built. And I know people want to get to the face, so we're going to do the face before we do the other rest of the lower half. And the rest of the lower half is really easy to do, and I'll start it right as soon as we're done with the face. And look at that, we're, almost, we're only 13 minutes into the video, so that's very good. I'm going to save it, just in case my Xbox freezes, or if I have to make any changes or something. Alright, so now that it's saved, let's go back up to what we have over here. Right here, you see where we have these two sticking out? That's where we're going to start the face. So to the left of here, we're going to put our placement block and we're going to put one block on top of that. So we're going up into left one. Then we're going to go up into left two flat. Then a single, then two flat again. And actually now I'm going to get the second controller in, so I'm going to freeze the video right here for you guys. Okay, so now we're back in with the adjusted camera and everything, and you can see what you've done. 
So where we left off at last, we had one, two, one, let me find. Alright, so we're going to go over to this two flat we have right here, and we're going to come up and to the left, three flat. And now we're going to start patterning in her face. So, going from above this block, we're going to go one, two, and then extend it over four more. So, one, two, three, four. Then we're going to skip one block again, extend it all the way over. And we're going to come over an extra two now. After that, we're going to skip another block. So, a little staircase pattern. And we're going to extend it over all the way again until we have two extra. So, it should look exactly like this. Now, from there, what we're going to do is we're going to go to this final block right here. And we're going to go up and to the left, three single blocks. Three. <coughs> Excuse me. And now we're going to continue going up and to the left. So we're going to go up and to the left, two vertical. Then we're going to go a single block. And then we're going to go up and to the left, two vertical again. And we're going to do that two times. Just like that. And I said two times, so here's them. And now we're about to hit the outermost part of her cheeks. So let's go back and keep on going up and to the left. We're going to go three, four, then five. And the five is going to be the outermost part. Four, and now from this point we're going to continue going up and to the right because we can't go any more left. So we're going to go up and to the right from here, three blocks, then two blocks, then one. So use our placement block to help you go up and to the right, three blocks. Two blocks. And then from there, we're going to go up and to the right two blocks three times. So make sure to keep yourself um, counted carefully. So we're going to do one. Times in a row. And from there, we're going to go up and to the right three blocks again. Actually, no, we were doing two, so it's not three blocks. It's three, then four, then ten. So, use your placement block. We're going to go three blocks up. And four blocks up. And then finally, ten blocks up. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Now, I don't think I'm going that fast that people can't pause or whatever, so if I am going too fast, be sure to tell me in the comments and I'll slow them. Tutorials. Alright, so from there, we're going to go up and to the right. Three, then two, then two. So, let's get our placement block. Three. Then placement block, two. And then finally, another two, and then we'll start some single block work. So, two. And you can see on the right screen, um, the shape is coming out on the head, because she does have a pear-shaped head. But anyways, we're going to go up and to the right now. Like, I mean, still, five single blocks. So, three, four, five. And then we're going to start going flat now, because we're at the top of our head. So we're going to go up to the right, two flat. And then from that two flat, what we're going to do is put another layer two on top of it, and then two more to the right. Three, 
Now from there, what we're going to do is we're going to go up and to the right two flat again. And from this newly placed two, we're going to put six blocks to the left of it. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we're going to start doing stuff like on another layer. So we're going to skip and go to another layer on top of it. We're going to put one block on this final one right here. And we're going to do two to the left, one to the right. It's helpful, more helpful actually. Now from there, what we're going to do is we have the four right here. We're going to go to this final block. We're going to put one on top of that and come over six to the right. So it's seven blocks. So it is as well. Five, six, seven. And now before we go to the right side, we're going to hit the top of this one by going up into the right seven twice. Actually, I'm going to correct myself there. We're going to go up into the right seven flat. So one, two. And then off of this final block, we're going to build our seven again. So one. Five, six, seven. And this is the top of her head. So now there's nothing left to do except go down. And I mean the ears are separate, so when I say there's nothing left to do, I mean there's nothing left to do for the head. <coughs> so to go downwards, we're gonna go down to the right and we're gonna put nine flat blocks. So use your placement block, we're gonna get nine, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. Then from there we're gonna go to the final block and we're gonna put one below it and put six to the right. So, one, two, three, one, two, three. So it's seven blocks in a row, just like this. So underneath this seven we have right here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put another six, and the six is gonna start underneath this. We're gonna skip this first block and then put this. And if you notice the little jump in the video there, it's because I filmed about 15 minutes of footage ahead of this part of the pixel art, and I ended up messing it up. So rather than um, work our way backwards to it because it turns out it took me about 30 minutes to fix it um, I'm just gonna redo this part of the pixel art. So if you notice the jump in frames right there, that's why so we're gonna put six right here So one two three And it's funny because the entire mistake was because I skipped this six right here And I ended up putting blocks ahead of it. So the entire pixel art got moved over by six and it was weird So anyways, we're gonna go to the last two right here and below it. We're gonna put two blocks just like that, two flat. And now we're going to start going down into the right to get the shape of her head. So, and actually here's another mistake I just made now. It's not two blocks like that. We're going to knock this one over and then we're going to put our two. Oh, uh, that would have been a pain if I made that messed that up. So I'm going to pay a little bit more attention now. So now we're going to go down into the right, two flat. And then from the final block right there, we're going to put one below it, one to the right. Then from there, what we're going to do is go down to the right three single blocks. So, one. Then what we're going to do is start going down into the right vertical blocks. So we're going to go down into the right two vertical. Then two vertical again. Then three vertical. So we're, all go we're always going down to the right right now. Until I specify otherwise. Then down into the right six. Now from there, we're going to almost be at the cheeks. So it's going to round off and then we're going to start going down to the left. But from that six, we're going to go down into the right three, three, and then two, two, two. So it's two sets of three. So this is set one. Set for the three. And now we need three sets of twos. So we're going to keep going down to the right. Let's do our twos. Two, 
two. All right, and then after that, we're gonna go down to the right two single blocks. And I'm gonna get rid of the placement blocks now because they bother me. Anyways, so from the two single blocks we just placed, we're gonna go down into the right two vertical, one single, then two vertical. So two vertical, single, and two vertical again. And then finally for the outermost part of the cheek, we're gonna go down into the right nine vertical. So down into the right nine, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And now we're going to start going down into the left until we touch down. So let me fix my second camera actually. Then two. So four, then two. Then we're going to keep going down to the left, and we're going to go three, two, one. So this is... And now finally, we're going to start doing some weirder patterns with the placement blocks. So this will help us. So after the one we just placed, what we're going to do is go down to the left two vertical. And from that final block we just placed, we're going to put one to the left, so it's a back. And then we're going to go down to the left, another backwards L, so put your place. It's the exact same three block pattern. And now finally, after that L pattern, what we're going to do is we're going to go down into the left. One, two flat, three flat, three flat. So... Perfect. And you should have this. So this is it for our head. And I think next we can start... Uh, actually, let me see how much time I have. So I'm probably going to do a little bit more before I end up cutting it off. Because right now we have about... I really don't know. I think it's 14 minutes of footage-ish. No. We have about 20, 32 minutes of footage. So, I think I'm going to cut it off there for part one, guys. Be sure to stay tuned for more parts. Um, I will be doing part two right after I stop this one. But I have to have them released regularly. So, that's why I just do them in parts. So, thanks for tuning in, guys. This is Phoenix Death One, and I'm out.